for the following public service announcement that was filmed for the Eastern North Carolina Jack and Jill of America, Inc. Mary Patterson wrote the script and was the director. One day I'm going to drive your car. One day I'm going to date your daughter. One day I'm going to be the father of your grandchildren. One day I'm going to be your doctor. One day I'm going to run your business. Don't you think I should be responsible? Because in the end, there's only one thing your son wants to be. Oh, man! To be able to trust me with cars, daughters, and your future. Teach me to be trustworthy. The future depends on it. Boys will be boys. But we still have to teach them to be responsible. This public service announcement is brought to you by the Eastern North Carolina chapter of the Mid-Atlantic region of Jack and Jill of America, Incorporated. For the following commercial that was filmed for Cornerstone Missionary Baptist Church, Mary wrote the script and was the director. Be strong and do it at the Cornerstone Missionary Baptist Church 2008 Wellness Conference. The keynote speaker is best-selling author Lisa Whittle. Be blessed by vendors providing free spa services, exercise demos, health screenings, and so much more. Kids, come and see the Nitro Truck and meet Sparky of the Greenville Fire and Rescue. There are even activities for infants and toddlers. Special sessions for teens dealing with everything from your money to your relationships. Healthy body, healthy finances, healthy spirit, and healthy relationships. Be there, be strong, and do do it. Style Plus was a syndicated television show that was broadcasted domestically and abroad for one season. Patterson produced and directed segments with Chris Tucker, Gabriella Union, Tracy Ellis Ross, and Robin Givens. The following segment was filmed at the red carpet of a Kentucky Derby Gala. We're here at Caesars Palace, and for those that don't know, this is the girlfriend. Tracy Ellis Ross. I love right. that. People like, the girlfriend. The girlfriend right here at Caesars Palace. What brings you out all the way to Louisville this evening? My hat and the Kentucky Derby. Where, where is it? Huh? Where's your hat? I sported it all day today. You can't wear it to the next event. What? I can't see it. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. I know it's beautiful. And the Grant Gala. I'm here for this. This is why I'm here. That's right. That's right. Yeah. And, you know, Style Plus is about style. And I, I tell you, there's a lot of style out here. What are you wearing? What is this on? I'm this wearing an Alexander McQueen dress and some Christian Louboutin shoes, which have a black tie on them. Mm -hmm. and, okay. and that's about it. And, and me and my pink lips. Finally! Robin Gibbons. We finally got her in the house. Yeah, it's a, it's about the. This is my you first. Wore that today? Yeah, I wore this today. Okay. And and it was my first derby. Mm -hmm. So you know you hear hats are the big thing. Mm -hmm. So right. I waited to get to Louisville to shop for a hat. Okay. Because you figured they probably have a great selection. Here. Well, yeah. Yeah, and there was pressure. I mean, there's pressure. So you hear roses, hats. All the other hats. Well, I'm just thinking, what kind of what kind of hat do you wear? What do you wear to the derby? How did you find this? Hat? So wait, okay, can they see this hat? Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. this yes, hat you got this hat now. Get a close up. So I went shopping with my son. Uh huh. And I saw all of these hats. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You saw this hat. Okay. Wait. 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 Oh. No. Yes. Yes. This yes. Doctor Seuss. Is that the look? Is that the look? Huh? 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 She's styling, profiling. That's the hat now. Dr. Seuss. So I thought, I thought, Dr. Seuss, green eggs and ham. So I thought it was a little sense of humor. You are where Dr. Seuss never looked this good. <laughs> I'm sorry. So that's what I thought. So I was, so that's what I'm I sure you turned some heads with that hat today. Uh, yeah, I'm telling you. It's hard to miss, huh? That's the right. The driver could find me in a crowd. You know that's what I mean? right. That's right. Yeah. Well, is this your first time coming out this year? My first time. Yeah. How do you like it? I love it. I mean, it's, you can't really explain it either. Mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. the excitement and when you're actually watching the horses and and there's there's so much on one race. It's pretty amazing. Yeah. And of course, you're here to enjoy the Caesar's Gala. Yeah, yeah. And uh, tell me something now. When it comes to style, off camera, mm -hmm. this is the, you know, we wanted to talk about the other part. You know, right. 
what is Robin style? Just at home? Oh my God. Um, oh, I, I am so like jeans, sweats. I wear, you know, my big son is old enough for me to wear his sweats. I'm like, okay. I'm so, you know, I think I think if you can look good in jeans and a tank and a, you know, white t-shirt, you know, okay. that, you can look good. You know, okay. man's boxer shirts, but you know, okay. and whatever makes you feel good. I think that's right. What makes you feel good? Yeah. Okay. And it's a really personal thing. And I think if you feel good, you look good. Okay. Now, what are you rock, what are you rocking today? What's this ensemble of the day? Oh, okay. Well, I didn't change it. Well, 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 this hat, okay, by by um, by Miranda Green, who's local in Louisville, and then Prada, because I like Prada. You like Prada? Yeah, I like. It's simple and elegant, and I I like I like that. All right. Well, I got the rest for you. You I did. You look very good, William. Good. It's I very. You did very. You did a great job. As the host of Project Slim. Mary produced segments with celebrities such as Celebrity Fit Club's Harvey Walden and many others. Good morning and welcome to Project Slim. I'm Sandy from the Big Apple and Mary is with us from the Dirty South. Good morning, Mary. Good morning and Sandy, I can't thank you enough. You booked Harvey Walden a couple of days before my birthday. I knew you loved me. I love you. Nothing but the best of you. <laughs> Well, let me tell everyone a little bit about Harvey. Uh, Harvey is a United States Marine drill sergeant and television celebrity all rolled into one. He joined the U.S. Marines at age 17 and still remains in active duty. He's an expert in weapons, ordnance, and has black belts for various types of martial arts. And if that wasn't enough, he also played semi-pro American football and was a running back for the U.K.'s London Mets. We all got to know and adore him and fear him a little bit from Celebrity <laughs> Fit Club. With his no-nonsense, tough love approach, he has motivated celebrities and everyday people to fight, fat, and win. Hi, Harvey. Welcome to the show. Hey, how you doing? Thanks for having me. Great. Thanks for being on. Well, jump hey, to it. Birthday. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Hoorah. <laughs> Let me try. Hoorah. Hoorah. <laughs> Hoorah. <laughs> Um, well, Harvey, are you a personal trainer, or how did you get involved in fitness? Uh, actually, I started out as a personal trainer. I was uh, living in London, and uh, they were they were starting this show called Fat Club. And I, I believe it or not, I wasn't too keen on doing the show, but I went ahead and uh, finally gave them the green light. After they, they were pretty persistent for me to do it, so I went ahead and and uh, did Fat Club and. Took off with Celebrity Fit Club over in London, and when I moved back to the States, we started over here. Mary Patterson handled all campaign communications, public relations, and crisis management for the City Council's member, Candy Smith. As Mid-Atlantic Regional Editor for the Jack and Jill of America, Inc., Mary supervised the process of creating, developing, and presenting content for the organization's regional publications, photo shoots, and websites, and maintaining the integrity of the brand. From executing events to meeting with royalty, political campaigns to television business commentator, Fortune 500 corporations, to nonprofit organizations, Mary Patterson has the business acumen, creativity, and communication skills to propel your organization forward to achieve its goals.